Tapping money on a hamster in the hopes of creating it on the spot? Millions of individuals worldwide are occupying their time in this way. Do you identify as one of them? You should watch this video. If not, perhaps you're curious about what in the world is happening. I refer to hamster combat, clicker game on Telegram that went viral and is said to have reached 300 million users in less than five months. That surpasses the combined populations of Nigeria, Pakistan, and Indonesia. As of right moment, the game boasts the biggest Telegram channel globally, and the numbers are rising. Why is this expansion so explosive? Why is the next big thing in cryptocurrency being discussed? And is this a real way to make money? Or is it just a massive scam? We've spoken with prominent figures in the gaming sector, as well as a crypto fraud detective. Get the real story. Please think about enjoying this video and joining our channel before we start. How everything began. We must take a step back in order to comprehend the phenomenon of hamster combat. It all began with Notcoin, a Telegram mini game developed by a team of developers known as Open Builders that debuted in January of last year. To win prizes in the game, players had to tap on an icon of a golden coin. At first, the incentives were worthless token. The game's creators did, however, make a hint that they might eventually be turned into real value cryptocurrency. The game has grown remarkably since its release, attracting over 35 million players in just five months. In contrast, at its peak in 2022, one of the most well-known cryptocurrency games, Axie Infinity, had only 2.7 million monthly active users. Ultimately, the open network blockchain saw the launch of the Notcoin cryptocurrency on May 16th, and it was listed on several significant exchanges, including OKX, Bybit, and Binance. Every Notcoin gamer received free cryptocurrency following the debut. This may have been worth several hundred bucks, depending on how well they performed in the game. That's not all though. Not much increased after introduction, and it even momentarily made it into the top 10 cryptocurrencies in terms of trading volume. And in 2024, Pan emerged as the Layer 1 blockchain with the quickest growth. Surprisingly, the network even outperformed Ethereum in June in terms of active wallets. It is hardly surprised that imitations of the successful game have started to appear on Telegram. Among these, Hamster Combat is the most well-liked. Players assume the position of a CEO of a Bitcoin exchange in Hamster Combat. By touching on the hamster, they can win coins, much like in Notcoin. In addition, players can develop their characters and increase the profitability of their transaction by using the acquired currency to buy special cards and boosters. That's not all though. In order to get cash, even when they aren't actively playing, players can also partake in staking. By using the game's referral system to invite new players, they can also receive additional benefit. Since its launch, Hamster Combat has grown exponentially, allegedly reaching 300 million users in July. The game now has the world's largest Telegram channel, with over 52 million subscribers. It also recently surpassed 35 million followers on YouTube. So what's behind all this excitement? Well, everybody is waiting for the game's token that is expected to launch on the TAN blockchain via airdrop on September 26th. Given the game's huge user base, this is likely going to be the largest airdrop in crypto history. Now, most of the tokenomics are still unknown, but according to a recent announcement, 60% of the airdrop will go directly to the community of players. Also, there's allegedly no venture capital or early investment involved, which means the token's value will be entirely driven by community interest, demand, and supply. What are the reasons behind the game's success? The what's behind the astonishing growth of these clicker games? The gameplay mechanics aren't new. They're reminiscent of idle games from the early 2010s, where you do simple actions to earn resources and unlock upgrades to progress faster. What makes the difference is, of course, the speculative element. Players are playing these games with the hope of eventually earning free crypto. Moreover, unlike crypto games we've seen before, these tap-to-earn games don't require an initial investment. Another groundbreaking feature is the convenience. I mean, you can just start playing these games directly through the Telegram messaging app. Precisely because of this simple onboarding process, Advocates of these tap-to-earn games think that Telegram could open up crypto games to the masses.
These games can now access Telegram's vast audience of around 900 million users worldwide. As reported by Russian independent media The Bell, Telegram is using these games to drive traffic and boost the app's popularity. The apparent goal is to promote Telegram as a super app like WeChat, which combines messaging, payment methods, and games. Long-term predictions and concern. But despite their increasing popularity, there are still some concerns about whether these games can be sustainable in the long term, and authorities around the world have issued warnings against hamster combat. So let's see how grounded these concerns actually are. First, many of these Telegram minigames haven't launched their tokens on exchanges yet, and they might not ever do so. Hamster Combat's previous delays in launching its airdrop have raised concern that the game might lose its community support. Another risk is that players might quickly sell their tokens after they launch, especially if there aren't enough reasons to keep them. Finally, the token's value could end up being very low. For example, if Hamster Combat gave the equivalent of fives to all 300 million players, the total amount would be massive. This is why some observers doubt whether all players will actually get rewarded in the end. So is there a chance that the hamster game is actually just one big scam? Well, it's kind of unlikely. Again, there's no initial investment that you have to pay, and that reduces a lot of the risk for direct f That being said, experts have warned about the manipulative nature of these types of games. They're designed to retain people's time and attention. This is how hamster combat generates revenue by selling traffic to advertisers. As the saying goes, if you're not paying for the product, you are the product. While the game itself is unlikely to be fraudulent, it's worth noting that in the crypto world, every innovative project tends to attract less trustworthy copycat. Experts also warn that scammers are already targeting the Tom blockchain to exploit the excitement around these games. Okay. Let's draw a few conclusions. The rise of Telegram tap to earn games like Notcoin and Hamster Combat is definitely something to keep an eye on. The allure of these potential profits without an initial investment is appealing, though it may not ensure the long-term success of these games. Much will depend on how these mini apps continue to provide value and incentives to players after their token launches. Therefore, it's probably wise to approach these with cautious optimism.